Hi there. Do you love science? Do you love the ocean? Do you want to help change the world? Well, then we need your help to collect information about abalone in our local tide pools to benefit our green abalone restoration project in Orange County, California. Hi, I'm Nancy Caruso. I'm a marine biologist and I work on projects to restore species in the ocean. I'm looking for some help with a very important project. My friends and I are trying to save a species. It's called an abalone. In this video, I'm gonna tell you about our project, what we need help with, and how to volunteer to help. There was a time when abalone were very abundant. They lived on every rock in the ocean. The problem is that they're snails, so they move really slow. So it was really easy to catch them. When humans figured out that they tasted good, we took as many as we could. Fishermen used to be allowed to take 1,140 per day. Abalone are large snails that can grow up to 12 inches long. They live in the kelp forests along the California coast. They're important because they're known as the gardeners of the forest. They help keep the reef neat and tidy by grazing on algae. Green abalone are a species that live here in Orange County in our underwater kelp forest. My friends and I spent 10 years restoring the kelp forest of Orange County when they had been gone for nearly two decades. Now we're trying to restore the species that used to live in them, like the abalone. Kelp forests are known as the rainforests of the sea, with more than 800 different species relying on them. We have lots of people who are helping us study the abalone on our coast, and we're even growing baby abalone on a farm that will be transplanted to the kelp forest when they're big enough. This is where you come in. We're looking for people to go out in the tide pools and help us look for abalone. We call them our Haliotis helpers because the scientific name for abalone is Haliotis. These helpers go out on the rocky shores at low tides and look for live abalone and for abalone shells. They collect information about them, like how long they are and where they're living, and send us that information. This helps us understand more about the abalone so we can help them. Would you like to be a Haliotis helper? If so, all you have to do is send us an email with your mailing address and we'll email you a link to watch the training videos, to learn everything you need to know. We'll also mail you a packet with all the tools you'll need to collect data about the abalone, including a caliper for measuring the shells, data sheets, and a field notebook, and also a cool Haliotis helper sticker. So here's my email address, nancy at getinspiredinc.org. Send me an email with all your information and you can get started right away. For more information about our projects and other species that we're restoring, please visit our website at getinspiredinc.org. Thank you so much.